Well, there's a part of you sometimes when you do shit like this, you think, man, maybe I should have done this the other way around. Because now I've got to try and pull this fish tank bottom off so that we can make an entrance. And it might have all been to no avail making all these rails, because if we wreck it, it'll be, I don't know, it'll be a big pile of glass on the bench, won't it? So we'll take all our top bars off that we've busily made. I'm gonna put them. That was like a top quality storage pot. <laughs> That'll work, wouldn't it? Sit them there. Oh, that'd be bloody right, wouldn't it? <laughs> That's a wrong size. Oh, man. Oh, I might be talking to the school sometime soon. That'd be kind of cool. Save the bees, one bush bee man at a time. <laughs> yeah, I'm not putting this stuff out of the way, son. Shit, let's kick the blooming thing. Right, we'll take these, see if we can get these little strips off for a start. That'll be a good thing. And then we're gonna take it over to the bench and see if we can get the bottom off it off. Where did I, I had a, where did I put that? I had a nice thin bit of metal thing somewhere, rather. You reckon we'll get this to bits without wrecking it? Oh, let that go a bit. Quite. <laughs> don't, don't smash it this close to the finish line. That sucks, mate. Let if we go this way, man. Start to cut it off a bit. Why don't I just use a bloody knife? <laughs> what about that for an idea? Look at that! That's one of the easy parts off. Oh. I was reading something that apparently glass is actually stronger than metal, but the only problem is it's more brittle. So it's technically stronger, because I was watching some discovery show yeah, watch out, I'll throw that in <laughs> and you make a mess. And they were saying they were they were considering making a glass bridge or something. Like a bridge made out of glass. And I thought that'd be kind of cool, wouldn't it? Imagine that. They better not put me on that work crew though. <laughs> that might be a bit exciting. Did they ever actually make a glass bridge? They never would have done that. That was probably just some crap that they had on the telly. Trying to bloody amuse me. Lots of that drifting and all that. Hey, if we had a 3D camera, you go, woo, 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 and everybody would be dodging in the cinema. They're like, oh my god, don't fucking flick me. <laughs> that 3D stuff's pretty cool, isn't it? The only thing is, sometimes they forget to have a story because they have that much cool sort of special effects. They forget they meant to have a story with it. Whether we have to take this bit off or not, I don't know. But anyway. Yeah. Oh, how's that? You've cut me per bits and I've not fallen apart yet. Oh, look at that. That's a bit naughty. Oh, shit. That was a bit stupid. Don't play with glass, kids. Yeah. Gosh. Now, just for entertainment, that was the easy bit. Right, there's an earthquake. <laughs> right, now I reckon we'll make ourselves a soft spot on the bench over here. And we'll see if we can cut the bottom off because I'm hoping we're going to cut the bottom out. And then I'm going to make a wood bottom so then I can make a little strip around it so I can have an entrance. Because I was trying to think about, I don't know, well, I'm not that clever. I don't reckon I'd be able to drill a hole through that glass without wrecking it. Or like so. Whew, smells like a dead fish in there. See if we can get it to the bench top without breaking it. I'm sure everybody will cry with me if I smash it. <laughs> well, probably half of you laugh at me and all, wouldn't you? <laughs> um. <gasps> smash. That's 
probably why it was given away. It's already cracked. <laughs> Is it in the box? Okay. What? <laughs> we well, just said that a minute ago. Oh, come on. Ah, safely stored away. Radio, Mr. Scrape off your slicking pots. Oh my goodness. Are we going to break this for sure? Aren't we? Shh, don't jinx yourself. You've got to be positive when it comes to these things. Special glass at the bottom. This is a bad idea. Yep. <laughs> Amazing shit. Wonder what. Wonder how they made fish tanks before silicon was invented. What have they done that? Is that what, I suppose they had fish bowls, didn't they? Like the, just a whole piece of glass and hot it up. Makes it hot. I'm not feeling real confident here. <laughs> I think we've got serious issues happening here. does soften the silicon a bit but I don't know I'm not completely convinced oh, watch out you cut yourself here I wonder I can... hey if I get sick of bush if I get sick of beekeeping I maybe I could become an aquarium fixer up <laughs> goodness gracious me You know what's going to happen when I want to go and plaster it. When I want to use this to plaster the corner of me blooming house. <laughs> It'll be all bent. And the wife will be going, why is that bloody corner look crooked? Oh, I don't know. I don't know what happened. Not sure what was going on there, honey. <laughs> This is when you get overconfident and you wreck something. <laughs> ta -da! Well, ta -da, yeah, you haven't got it off. <laughs> Isn't that right? Oh, we've got one corner off. It's got reinforced wire, but I think I've already said that. What the hell? Ah, you bloody wretch. What are you doing? Don't want to get impatient about here because <laughs> I'll just go clink! I'll be like, oh, damn it! That's already had a bit of clink off the edge there. That wasn't even me. Maybe we'll go the other end. 
doesn't want to be in it. It doesn't want to let go for some reason. I don't know why. It's like it's just not quite square or something. There can't be some sort of crazy safety bit at a certain height or something, can there? I don't know. I've never actually put a fish tank together and I think this is the first one I've ever pulled to bits. I'm fairly sure they're not actually meant to be pulled apart, are they? Why doesn't that want to be in it? Come on! What are you doing? It's like there's a little bump there or something. Is this when you break something? Yep. <laughs> I think this might be about the part of the project where the bloke breaks something. Anyway, we'll see. Hopefully not. No. Bugger. That was a little supporting pole went. There's the speed hump. Shit. <laughs> Try that the other end. Yeah. That's not good. not going for. Oh, come on, you best. Oh, shit. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's, that's a slightly longer. I think the cameraman's just waiting for the kaboosh. <laughs> and it all just goes, <laughs> and there's a great big crack. And there we go. Guess what? There's not going to be any observation hive. For all you folks that happen to work in the aquarium repair shop, just relax, this is the first one I've wrecked, or tried to undo. So feel free to message us and tell us what I did wrong, or how I should have done it. Mind you, it'd be a bit late to help me then. <laughs> I don't know what that's about. Or something. Here we go. We're nearly there. We're nearly there. Don't get excited now, Bush to Bush Man. So, this is the moment when you get all excited to think you've had a victory and something bad happens. Like that bottom lip comes with you and you don't want to take off. Damn it. That's not meant to happen. Oh, it's anyway. That bit was meant to stay in there. Oh, well, that little extra flat bit, I was hoping to leave it in there, a bit of strength, but anyway. <laughs> it might be a bit rickety now. To the bin, to the bin we head. <laughs> well, I don't think it's really happy. <laughs> oh, I wonder if, no, we just broke that strip anyway, didn't we? So it's no good. No good to us anyway. Oh, okay. Shit! <laughs> good God. Nobody go playing in that bin, alright? Oh, shit. <laughs> <sighs> right. Yeah, see if we can clean all this muck off. I don't think these bottom lips are going to do too much now that we've taken that off. I mean this bit here is meant to be to hold the edge so you have the little piece there so you can silicon a bit extra so you silicon its edge and silicon that bit. But if we treat it with a bit of love and kindness we should be right. Do you think? Now I think if we tip it up 
on its edge, end, thing, whatever it's called, that way, without smashing the thing. Then my plan is, oh, so I'd have to cut myself. The plan is to clean this up a bit and then put a wooden base and then put a little 10 mil or eight mil strip around to make the let and make one end an opening. Shaving is this, <laughs> no, shaving a fish tank and that's all. 